Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and today we are going to see about uh, PG Health HL means Product and Gamble Health Limited. Actually there are two shares in this, one is PG Health Care which is around 11,000 rupees. But this share is unknown to a lot of people because uh, people never see it guys. And the first thing is note that this share is in the range of 4,322 and in this video we are going to see whether to buy the share or sell the share or hold the share what is the future target for this share guys so before all starting this video uh, if you are new to this channel then make sure you hit the subscribe button below so that you could get our latest updates regarding many shares and let's go to the video guys the first and foremost thing is that the book value of the share is around 1023 rupees 1023 rupees into 4 times we multiply that means price to book is around 4322 which we get the share price so if you ask me whether the share is fairly valued or largely valued means this share is overly valued the reason because the industry price earning industry price earning is around 32 rupees but if we see guys this company is having a PE ratio of 45 percentage so if we see there is I, I already said guys here 45 times it is being overvalued where the industry average is 32 so what is the basic reason for this overvaluation if we go and see in the balance sheet if we, 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 we can find that the loan and the borrowings are nil or very very less for these companies and that's the main reason this company is overvalued but not only debt is a main important thing but the other main thing is that the amount of profitability this company is trying to earn but if you see guys in this type of economy this, this company is trying to earn a correct profit but that is not much expected and the next thing is that this company is having a EPS growth of 95 rupees so guys now let us see the financial performance of this company so that let us know about it because February 7th the result has came and now as you can see here this is a quarterly result they are showing guys and the revenue has been increased if you see quarter on quarter basis and also year on year basis and if you see the expenditure has been made in the same level but the profit before depreciation and tax PBDT means profit before depreciation and tax is around 55 crores which means previous September quarter they are around 56 crore and previous June quarter 72 crore and December quarter previous year 22 crore if we compare year on year basis there is a 50% jump or I mean, double the jump of fees uh, profit but if we compare quarter on quarter, there is a stagnant performance in this company. And also you should know that net profit is coming around 38 crores. I mean, if you see a uh, major difference as you can see here guys, uh, you can see in December 3rd, 18, it was 715 crores. The main reason of the overall profit in that time, the reason because of the discontinue of a certain operations, which made an exceptional item to come and they have earned this profit and this was the main reason for it and also you should note that the EPS growth has been constant from 24 rupees it's trying to end in the range of 23 rupees 24 rupees and net EPS is coming around uh, this sort of 95 96 rupees but keeping all these facts away people can tell me uh, guys it's a def definite buy I will, I, will, I will answer this in three questions can I buy now I'm already holding the share can I hold yes guys you can definitely hold the share can I sell the share I will answer that also guys so first of all buy the reason uh, why one should buy this share because the debts are zero but the price of buying is very very important because in this share if you notice guys the debt is almost zero but the profit at this time has been affected February 7 the result has came of February 10th guys and today is the market opening now let us see able to correction if we get the share up to 3800 3800 or 3500 that would be the best best buying range or we can say that instead of going and buying at that range when the share decreases 200 rupees or 100 rupees buy it part by part never buy this bulk share at a single price because you cannot be able to average and you cannot be able to determine how much price can rise and also you should note that uh, if you can take risk and if you believe the results are very very good then you can definitely buy but the main fact you should note guys uh, I think from February 11 to 13, Delhi election results are going to come and which may affect the big shares like these companies and many other companies index stocks. So I think that type of correction time that would be the best buying range to buy this share. Maybe if we get around 4,000 rupees to 3,800 rupees. I think within this year and we may can see, we can see P 
PNG in the range of 5000 to 5500. I repeat again, if the daily election results can give a correction to shareholders to buy a beautiful shares, you could buy the share in the range of 4000 to 3800 and you may see a target of 5000 to 5500 within the year end because this company is having a great potentiality and also you should note that the outbreak of various diseases which is been going around and this healthcare pharmaceuticals can provide a good thing and let us hope a good news coming for PNG.